There is a fevered fascination with the lives of the royal family. But what about the people working within palace walls? And with the King and Kate off work, how the household works is more important than ever. But palace PR is nothing new. An exhibition lifts the lid on historic life inside Kensington Palace. I think the fact that the royal household in times of boom uh, in the country tends to grow and reflect the uh, ambitions of the monarch suggests that the household is essential for the, the well-being and the presentation of the monarch themselves. And when things are not so good and money is tight, the household shrinks back again. The significance of staff is painted on the walls. This, the king's grand staircase, showing the court of George I. There were so many gaps in the, in the royal household because these are ordinary people and their records are not kept. Many positions no longer exist, like the groom of the stool, a royal toilet attendant. And he was a lord and he was one of the king's right-hand people. And from royal privies to royal pests and the team of rat catchers, complete with special coats. They had a uniform, which is a red, a scarlet coat, a blue lining, and it had gold embroidered rats and wheat sheaves. But the different roles all have one job, keeping the royal show on the road. <laughs> and there are parallels with today, as Photogate proved, getting public relations right matters. Well, the PR is obviously, obviously vital, and the, the royal family, who aren't always in touch, don't really, can't read the nation quite so well as someone who actually has contact with the real world. They rely on the, the advice for these people for what to do. But sometimes, of course, they ignore the advice. PR problems are nothing new, but the old royal court didn't have modern social media. The role of staff has changed, but their influence and advice is ever relevant. Laura Bundock, Sky News.